Well, hey everybody, happy Tuesday, and this is a big day. It is the first 2024 Baseball Cards of the Year, uh, Top Series 1. We got two of these, uh, I guess they call them the Hobby Boxes. Um, should be one autograph or relic per box. Uh, I've only seen one of these ripped so far. Uh, we ordered two of them. I'm not going to be doing a lot of rips. Uh, Liam and I and the family are getting most of our inventory uh, outside of the rips uh, game now. Uh, really just chasing a couple of things in here for our personal collection. We will sell off the rest. Um, just want to get a couple of Ellie De La Cruz's as our goal. Uh, two boxes. We should get at least one of them. And um, yeah, so this should be fun, guys. Excited to uh, look at the new product. There is the silver pack. We will save that for last. Uh, that's going to be your mojo cards. And then, uh, like I said, we're chasing either one autograph or relic. I haven't seen a relic yet, so I don't know what those are going to look like. I'm sure they're going to be those disgusting manufactured relics. Uh, hopefully not those big old fat, goofy round things like last year. Uh, anyway, without further ado, I'm going to go through these pretty quick. And it's funny. Oh, these actually look really good. Um, these are going to be condition sensitive, though, guys. You see that black on the top? Um, they will be prone to chipping, I'm sure. There's Dane Myers, new rookie. Ryan Mountcastle. Got Tyler O'Neill. There's Paul Goldschmidt. Coco Montez. And there's a little parallel for the 1989 style, which is kind of cool. I'd love to see one of these in a Griffey. Uh, maybe send it off to get graded. We do have one of those in a Gem Mint 10 in our PC. Uh, so we need to have uh, one of the new, I guess, 35th anniversary. Golly, crazy to say that. 35th anniversary. I can remember opening those 1989s up when I was a kid. And Carmen, I don't even know how. We're going to have to figure out how to pronounce his name if he's any good. Uh, new rookie, Christian Walker. That's yeah, pretty cool. LA Dodgers. Uh, looking forward to seeing. There we go. Check that out. Celebration of the Kid. Ken Griffey Jr. We were just talking about it. I guess if you talk about it, it comes true. Uh, I was going to say in that Dodgers, uh, be really cool to see Yamamoto and uh, Otani in there very soon. Uh, looking forward to uh, seeing some games on TV. Uh, sick of watching Sports Center during the day. That's really cool too. Check out the American Le Leaders card. That's got Otani, Garcia, and Lewis Robert. I know this probably be worth 10 cents six months from now, uh, but right now I'd call that a hit. We got Otani. Looking forward to that Dodgers uniform. Wish he'd have moved further east so we could watch him play live and in person. There's Jazz Chisholm. There's Danielle Palencia. Bryce Elder, Weimer. There we go. Check that out. Blast at 121 mile per hour exit velocity home run. That's because he's jacked. Got a little Acuna for the PC. I'm sure we'll end up with a couple of those. And I'm going to try and go fast since we've got two boxes here. Blue Jays Unite. Hopefully I don't miss anything. I'm sure there's going to be image variations, but who the heck knows what those are quite yet. I'm sure we'll figure them out later down the line. There's Joey Votto. I think he's probably nearing the end of his career. And uh, we actually had some. Oh, there we go. Finally, only took four packs. We got our Ellie. We get that sleeved up. Not sure if that's the one we'll send off to grading, though, because that is super off-center left to right. Expect for these brand new products there. Quality control will be really good, but never know. No complaints. I'm sure we'll get a couple of them. Zach Galoff, Ryan O'Hearn. There's Sedane Raffaella in the 89 style. Cool to see those. I wonder if those are going to be all rookies, because so far we've got the rookies and then the kid. Celebration of the kid. And that's cool, too. Look at the future stars. I uh, like that they've got a little bit more color in it this year. 
Those were always my favorite and favorite of the 87 tops that Bo Jackson with that Future Stars. I uh, always thought those were really cool. There's Grant Hartwig. Sal Frelick. Lika Williams. These are some new names. Oh, and there's a Julio. Sleeve that up. Let's see what this is. This is an all tops team Julio. That's pretty cool. We'll stick that down there. I think that one's stage worthy. Like I said, that's probably going to be a 10 cent card six months from now. Uh, just enjoy ripping this brand new stuff. There's another Julio right afterwards. Very cool. Nick Robertson. Johan Rojas. And there's Nick Gonzalez. And then next, we got our National League leaders. That's Blake Snell, Kodai Senga, and Justin Steele. Golly, I didn't realize Blake Snell carried a 2.25 ERA. That's very cool. Guess I'll throw a sleeve on that one as well. And I think uh, some of the bigger guys that buy tons of product, uh, they got these things over the weekend. Uh, unfortunately, I'm not as cool as them. I did have them overnight or just because I like to be one of the first. Uh, there's a National League leaders, Spencer Strider, 20 wins, Zach Gallon, Justin Steele. There's Luke and Baker. Matt Olson. There's Brian De La Cruz. Kevin Gaussman. And there's Brian Buxton. So I guess these are just a little insert. Uh, nothing overly fancy. There's Hunter Green. I don't have the pack odds pulled up. I'm not going that crazy. It's just Series 1. What's good about these is they're not overly expensive. Uh, I could probably buy this exact box six months from now for less than what I paid for it. So that's Series 1 is definitely not the, the thing that jumps to the moon as far as prices. And Desert Dance-Off, Perdomo and Marte celebrate a W... There's Chris Morrell on the Future Stars, and then Dalton Varsho. So far, so good. Curtis Mead. The quality's pretty good. That's cool. Seeing the Matt McLean with the Rookie Cup. I think this guy's going to kill it this year. Looking forward to seeing him and Ellie and those guys getting rolling. Another guy that's going to kill it this year, I think Anthony Rizzo. Yankees, now that they've got Juan Soto, is going to be a lot of fun. Uh, see them bounce back from the depths of despair. And there's Aaron Judge speaking of the Yankees. There's Chris Morrell. This hits his walk-off home run. And there's Corbin Carroll, his rookie cup card. Very cool. I think that's a really neat card. I'll tell you what's crazy about Corbin Carroll. He gets the MVP. Has an amazing year. I go to the series. That guy's cards have gone down in value in the offseason, which is really weird. Um, got a lot of his stuff gemmed up, and uh, they're just not selling like I expected. I don't know if it's just a smaller market, being in Arizona. Keaton Wynn, Max Muncy, and check that out. There's our mem. So I kind of expected that. So instead of an auto, we got a Nick Prado with the napkin card. It does say player worn, so good on you, Tops, but good Lord. Much rather have an auto. It is Nick Prado for the Royals. Anyway, that's what you expect from Tops. You gotta pay for those high-end products to get the autographs. This cheaper stuff, you're just not gonna get that lucky, I don't think. We might still get lucky, but we'll see. Then Attendee, there's the Ohapi. The future stars, yeah, there's a couple future stars. Hunter Brown, Logan Ohapi, Alec Boom. There's the Yankee Sluggers, and there's Jordan on the 89 style. So it looks like it's about every three packs on that 89 style card. Make a little room down here. Getting a good pile of rookies going. There's a cool one. Check out that Elites of the Game, Otani and Betts. It's a good-looking card. 
And we got one backwards here. So this is probably going to be our, I guess it's the foil card. Let's check it out. So not too bad. At least we got a rookie on the foil card, Chris Murphy for the Red Sox. And that's a cool one. Check that out with Bobby Witt. That's a really neat picture with him sliding into base and then right behind it. Of course, Randy, his arms crossed. Looking like he's about to beat somebody's rear end. We will take that on the silver foil. And I'm sure this stage, if we were to open much more of this, would definitely not look like it does right now. I guess at least we got what we were looking for with the Ellie. The Mitos. And yes, there's bearer. And here's something different. Grand Gamers. So the old school guy, Grand Gamers. We got Ted Williams, little insert. We got Jacob Amaya. And there's Kano on the Rookie Cup card. I do like that they got a Cooney on the front. They gave the MVP the nod this year he's on the front of the box jocks vladdy hopefully vladdy gets his act together this year and has a much better year than he did last year Dell. have to learn some of these names hopefully get to see a lot of these new guys down in spring training we're trying to go to a few games we're going to head down in March and uh, possibly that last, the mid-March and then the last week in March. Going to take our RV down and go try and catch a couple Bra Bravos games. That's cool. Pick a sh pick a game for a shot to win. Adley Rutschman home run challenge. There's a gold. So there's our first gold. We got Alex Diaz from Cincy, numbered out of 2024. So our first gold card of the year. And down to four packs. That Olsen. Probably start seeing some doubles here soon. Oh, that's a cool one. Man, this reminds me. I'm trying to remember what year. I believe it was 2004. They have this blueprint style card. That's a Tatis Blueprint card, so that's very cool. I like that insert back then, and I like it again. That's a good on you, Tops, for bringing that one back. There's Jordan Westberg for the O's. Got my O's hat on right now, as a matter of fact. So anyway, saying we're going down to spring training. Uh, have never been before. Uh, Going to take Liam and Lucy, uh, two of my kids, down. For their spring break in March, and then it uh, looks like we will take Maddie and Abby uh, the end of March, beginning of April. And that's cool. There's an Ellie, Resilient Reds, Youth of Cincy getting it done. And then we've got another one turned around. So let's see, that's a silver. So this is our Reds box for sure. Nick Senzel. So we got quite a few of our hits. So we got the Ellie, got the Kid. Alexis Diaz in the gold, and then we've got a silver here, another Reds player. I'm going to have to readjust this uh, stage. I didn't expect to set so much up. Having fun, though. Fun to open up some 2024. I am looking forward to the season. Looking forward to having the games on during the day while I'm working. Michael Harris, the Korea shower. Seems like Tops is putting a lot of those uh, people dumping water. There we go. Check that out. Donny Baseball. That's a good insert. I'm happy to get one of those. In the 89 style. Like I said, it is crazy to see 35 years since that 1989 set came out. I can remember ripping those things as a kid. There's a good one, Anthony Volpe on the Future Stars. Angels, Adley. Weird to see Adley without that rookie card symbol beside his name. And then, last but not least, on this box, and there is a chance that you can get an auto in these things. So, we will see. So there's Arias, 
And I guess all these mojo cards are going to be in the 89 style. So there's Arias. We got Miggy. And there's Sedane Raffaella. Check that out. Here we go. Evan Carter. This is a good one, guys. So we got the auto in the mojo on the Evan Carter. So we got the mem. And uh, I was hoping something like that would happen. We got us a really good hit here. So that is box one, guys. Uh, not going to do two at once just because that's going to be a lot of video since we're 15 minutes in. But I think we did pretty good for our very first box of 2024. Uh, hit that like button. Love for you to subscribe. Uh, we do rips occasionally, but mostly we are uh, posting kind of how-to videos on uh, how we run our operation for our uh, sports memorabilia. Uh, company. And uh, thank you so much for watching and have a wonderful rest of your week. Bye-bye.